and welcome back to another episode and uh, yeah as you can see we've got something rather different than this one and uh, yeah we're just going to have a quick fire unboxing and first impressions of this cheap £100 eBay bait belt that I've picked up as you can see there there we go so, yeah there's the box wrapped pretty decent as you can see no damage to the box let's get straight in but yeah I've been, um, I've already got a bit of these for you guys now and I've got the wave runner at them and, uh, and I've recently been having some problems with the batteries and stuff like that not lasting it's been doing like two drops and uh, the, the batteries have just been dying and so um, I've been to Trevview this weekend and I've been using uh, one of my mates bait boats this one exactly and uh, I've had a joke to him saying that if I caught a fish using it I'd uh, get one so here we are um, and another few issues that I was having with the wave runner was um, the steering on it and it not being the one handed control and um, this has got the one handed control on it and it's just so easy to use, so cheap, I mean it's 100 quid so yeah, uh, you can't really go wrong so yeah, so open so, so yeah I've already, re I've already used it, not this particular one but I've used it before so yeah there we go, we've got like the, the value pack, I'll flash it up on screen now Uh, the one I got off eBay, but it's one with the like, bag and stuff like that. So there you got um, a bag for you, for it. And then you get a uh, control. Control there, one handed like I said. And then you got your aerial there. And it should come with some batteries, but I don't know where they are at the minute. That's a charger. Got a charger in there, which is nice. Under the charger. Instructions. Which is probably in gibberish. Fish is the life of my life. What a package! I don't know that. And the weight of it is absolutely insane. Like wow. Twin motors at the back there. Yeah, man. Now that's in the box. Now this is where you've got your batteries and these spare propellers, screws, stuff like that. So that's nice. I'm guessing that you, you can get spare batteries for this, but I'm guessing it's got a built in one. You can clip that on. Put your cap back on. You just need to go grab some batteries, I think, for this handset. There we are. Switch her on. Got an on remote on button there. Uh, which is quite simple. You can hop a battery aerial. Simple as that. You've got your two night lights up front, two at the back. Switch your uh, handset on. Let me show you the handset. Nice and simple. Um, we've got your left, your left one opens a hopper. I think either the top or bottom puts the lights on and I'm not sure about the rest. But that's what I learnt using it this weekend anyway. You've got your button at the front to lock um, the position that you're going to be driving in. So when you're sending it to the to the spot or whatever, you can lock it into the, the position once you go. And uh, it'll lock in, which I'll show you now. So switch that on. That's on. And then, like I said, if you push that forward and click that at the back, it's 100. And then you click that and it'll stop. And then same when you're driving it back. So that's handy. Um, and I also noticed, like I said, the, the control on this is amazing. It just goes in a straight line when you send it. Compared to the Wave Runner, it's mint. And um, like I said, left to drop the hopper. Um, and I think it's the front, front arrow on the pad. For the for the night lights. So yeah, there we go. Um, just a quick little unboxing and first impressions of this bait boat. Like I said, I've already caught a fish using it. Not this particular one, my mates. Um, so I know the work, but obviously I'm going to do a, a review on uh, how I get on with it using it in the next few months. And uh, yeah, hopefully it does us a few fish. But yeah, really impressed. 
Packen wir vom Rekord. There she is, the new vessel. You might be thinking, what a load of sh mate. It is the best piece of kit for the money I have ever bought. 100 quid off eBay. But yeah, as you can see, I've made a little adjustment to Opper. Uh, if, you are, if you are, I've had it about, I don't know, a month now. And I had a problem with this hopper splitting. So what I did at work was mech, as you can see, a strip of nylon just so it thickens it up a bit it's uh, literally about that thin and it just snapped with the with the pressure of the the spring loaded pins there and as you can see I've put a load of foam on that back just for a bit of shock absorber but yeah man hopefully she should be alright out there so first things first pull up the deeper up I've attached the deeper to the boat just with a trace, simple trace um, get that to right of that. Put that over there. Line that side. So rigging first. Load of the house pellet tramp view. Make sure that's not as tangled. And for hook bait on this one, as you can, as you saw, it was just an 18 millimeter fully loaded. 18 mil cut down just to look like a like a pellet like such get that filled up bit of the old goo just to give it a bit more oomph in there. right that's on get my remote turn her on Connect. Hopefully, seeing it's 50 chuffing foot at a minute, which it is not. Just close that up again and start it all again. There we go, sorted. All right, let's go. So we've got a one-handed control, pretty much simple. You press forward, press that back button. So you set, send it in the direction you want to go, hit that back button, and it'll go in a straight line. And as you can see, we're getting a beautiful reading up on that. Happy days. Uh, 23 pounds six ounce. So yeah, a nice, uh, a nice fish. Said it were low twenties. Fought like a dog. Thought it were a lot bigger than what it was. Yeah, but that hope that looks nice in that, that, that early afternoon sun. But yeah, man, buzzing. Took a little orange fluoro northern special dumbbell wafter and dropped with the bait boat. So yeah, man, happy days.